Hey, that guy. What's up, that girl? I am really sad. I thought you were excited. I was, you guys. I was so excited. I've wanted to stay at Cromwell for years. Correct. Years. And years ago is probably when you should have stayed. I there. should have. And, you know, we came in trying to be positive because we've seen some things that haven't been great on TripAdvisor and whatnot. But we thought, okay, you just never know with TripAdvisor. So, unfortunately, mostly what we're going to, we're going to show you the room, of course. We got the king, just their king standard room. Um, but we are going to be focusing a lot on the negative because there's a lot of negative in here. So, I mean, on the surface, like the furniture... You know, they put a lot of thought into decorating this mm -hmm. place, but on the it's other cute. hand, I kind, of, I felt, kind of felt like I just stepped into a whorehouse. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just saying. Just saying, okay. Anyways, yeah, so, so you walk in, here's your bed. These rooms are about, I think, 360 square feet, so they're small. Um, they've got, you know, the fake wood floor, which I like. Um, thank God it's not carpet. Can you imagine if it was carpet? Oh my gosh. But we like it, but it also means that they don't use a regular vacuum here, yes. which is going to lead us to some of our other, yes. I don't know, nitpicky discoveries. Yes, whatever you this call ain't it. nitpicky, guys. This is not, I'm sorry. But, so they probably don't, carry, don't stay here. maybe they carry a dust buster yeah. around. So over here, like I said, there's definitely, you know, normally I'd be like, oh, it's so cute. Look at the cute couch. It's so cute. You know, look at the, this is a 21 and up hotel, so keep that in mind as well. Look at the cute picture here, but, okay, so go ahead. One of the things you look at is is, is, is the, the stuff that isn't obvious to clean yes. should be stuff that's clean. Yes, so, and we didn't pick this up right away, guys. We just, after we saw other stuff, we're like, let's look hey, and see. If I want candy <laughs> under my sofa, I'll stay home. Sofa candy. Yeah, you can see, okay, wear and tear. I can deal with stuff like this. This scratch, I get it. it. They haven't remodeled this hotel in 10 years. I get that, but I'm gonna show you in just a minute what I can't. But anyways, here's a nightstand over here. The lighting in here, guys, is not great. So if you need a lot of lighting, not the place for you. Um, here's back here with some, just a couple plugins. Um, it's. 10 years so you don't have your USB ports in here. This is like really what's making us think we need to find some place else to stay. It's the small, it's the little things, the details. But look at, look at that. Ew, ew. This hasn't been cleaned probably in a couple of years. Yeah, ew, ew, ew. And look like in between here, I it's have, just like dust. Nobody's ran a towel up and down yeah. between that. And ew, 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 ew. Um, that guy, can you shine the light yeah. down here please? No, at the bottom. But look at the bottom. Oh. Yeah, it's pretty nasty. This is nasty, guys. There's some stuff on the other side. Okay, <laughs> well, we'll go check it out. We'll go check it out. Okay, so over here, you've got your entertainment area. And even like in its day, it had to have been super, super cute. But now it's just worn. Yeah. And in here, of course, is your do not touch these nuts ice cooler or not ice cooler refrigerator whatever even I'm really if they're sad. chocolate coated don't touch these nuts yeah oops gimbal <laughs> issues okay um yeah and i hate when they put things out like this because you might knock them you do get a keurig machine and some paper cups that tells me too that this is no longer they're not trying to make this a nice hotel like it used to be because they're giving you paper cups here, it is a, it, it the yeah, here is like, oh, look, that's cool. That falls out. Oh, some type of desk thing. I'd normally say isn't that cute, but I'm kind of not in a good mood. Um, light over here, you know, once again, didn't clean, dirty. Um, even this, I love, oh, God, look at that guy come on now look you see what i'm seeing right you know that's disgusting oh my god oh. and i don't care some people out there are gonna go oh you you know it's a your nitpick or whatever i'm yeah. sorry i just like to stay in a clean room yeah and this shows that they put zero effort into actually cleaning you know? yep big mirror over there that guy walking okay here's your other nightstand come back to this side where was the worst part of it 
some spooky stuff down there. I'm not sure what that is. Yeah. Don't look what he is. But and you can, yeah. yeah. Oh wait, that guy. Can you shine it behind there again? So if you have an allergy to dust, you, you can't, can't stay, stay here. Okay. Um, not today. I mean, you can just tell, look back, even back there. Like back okay, there. hold on, I'm coming. We're going this way. You can tell they run a, a swifter down the middle of the floor, and that's it. They don't get under or anything. Yeah, it's just dirty. Okay, so here's your armoire. Plenty of room. I did notice, once again, can you shine the light, that guy? That guy's job today is to shine the light. But yeah, they don't they don't clean here. But this is where you can hang some clothes if you get stuck staying here. I think this first review you've done where I have to walk around with a flashlight. Yeah. And then here's this. For some reason the blow dryer's out here. Weird. I don't know. Well, we should put the iron in the bathroom then. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Um we'll get to the door in a second. Um, so here, I'm always super excited when there's a vanity, but I... From Tombstone, Arizona. Yeah, but, you know, it's it's kind of not great, dirty. Um, we're on the fifth floor. There's only four floors here, I think. So, you know, dirty window. I mean, okay view, but we'll see how loud it gets over here. I don't think, I think we're going to be okay as far as that goes. But we're gonna close this because it helps with the lighting. Tiny bathroom, which is fine. That's what I would expect. Um, this door, we'll show you the other side. This is hard to see, but it's just, you can tell they don't clean it. I just, you know, I like Here. once again, I think people are gonna say, uh, it's being nitpicky, but, but look, if I was having people clean this room and what I pay for is to run a towel over this. Yeah, how long does it take? Every time. Like Ew. It's, I've just cleaned it for them. Yes. And now I'm breathing dust. Yes, yes. Well, I will say this chandelier above our head is super cute. <laughs> Looking for the positives here, not many guys. Okay, small bathroom, but that would be standard. Um, you've got the vanity there, but here's your sink. You know, very worn. I could deal with the worn, and so I'm okay with that. Um, it looks like this one is missing something up top because another light. And then here is the beautiful ceiling. So obviously they've had some issues with water here. Okay, over here um, is your toilet. They could have easily put a door on here to give you a water closet. I'm trying to figure out the light switch. I know. They're, the light in, the, in the, here doesn't work. You get a little window, which I guess is not you know nice. It just shows you that the remodel from when it was the old hotel. No screen. I mean, luckily it's not big enough for anybody to get in. It is good for one thing. Help! Help, <laughs> Help us! This is icky. Okay. Um, toilet. I didn't really check the toilet. It looks fine. Um, back in its day, I'm sure this is a really cool shower. Not so sure about the mirror in the shower, but you know, whatever. Look over here. There's stuff. And then shower looks looks really cute, but wear and tear. So here we go. Sorry guys, it's getting janky. Oh, here we go. Just oh, this was the other thing. I knew there was something else I really wanted to show. Look at this door. Like come on. And Cromwell is supposed to be one of Caesar's more upscale places. It's not. And dirty down here. All right. Yeah, that guy. Used to be upscale. Yeah, that guy. And then it's just not. And I want to point this out, guys. If we're seeing, people will sometimes say when we've stayed at places, I mean, I'm just kind of walking you, showing you the ick. Um, Did you get all the way back in this chair? No, I don't know. I mean, just look at just it. Every right. hole. It's disgusting. Like I not look all the way back there. It's just oh, disgusting. Ew. Oh, oh, oh! Look, look through, look, 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 look through, look, look, look right there. Look at the screen. Oh, there. Oh. I won't sit on that chair. There's no damn. Oh God, guys! I don't know. We got to figure out a way to get out of this place. It's gross. 
All right, I'm gonna sit on the couch, that guy, and wrap, wrap this, this up. <laughs> um, literally. Literally. Um, yeah, so guys, super, super disappointed. Now, I only paid $30 a night, and because of our tier matching that we did, go watch our tier magic, um, we were able to get up to Diamond for Caesars property, so we didn't pay any resort fees here, so it's 60 bucks for two nights. So we're not complaining about we're the price. We're not complaining about the price. It, I would, I'd be even more pissed if I paid more than that. Yeah, I just, um, yeah, exactly. It's just if you were paying full price, you'd be pissed. It's, it, it's just gross, guys. So take your money someplace else. Don't come to Cromwell. The rumors are true. I tend to, <laughs> I should believe them, but I tend to go, well, you know, maybe it wasn't that bad. Oh, and also I didn't point out, and this bums us out because we don't like watching regular TV. You cannot use a fire stick or Roku or hook your computer up to the TV here. It does not come out it of the wall. It doesn't come out of the wall. It's got that cool frame around it, but you can't get your hand back. So. And I just want to say real quick too. Yeah. That when, when I can walk in here and in two minutes go, they've got hard floors in here, which means they don't bring a regular vacuum in here. Maybe not even a vacuum at all, except maybe a little yeah. dust buster. That's why you have the dirtiness between the box spring. That's why the chair looks like crap because they don't bring a normal vacuum in here with no. attachments on it. Yeah, so, so there you guys have it. Icky, icky, icky. I, I, I'm still, I'm just sad because I thought, hey, this might be our hotel we really like. The location I'll say is amazing. I didn't want to stay um, here. Shut up, that guy. It's for the channel. Yeah, there's thing. You know, we like the little casino. It's cute. We we've won here before. Um, parking. Not there's not a lot of parking. There was basically one level of covered parking. Yeah, and that's it. Sun. Yeah, so we got lucky to find <clears throat> a parking spot. Um, no, we got to check in at three instead of four, so uh, just an hour early check in. Um, and oh, the, the but the elevators in the parking lot that yes. tells it the story, guys. Worse than uh, circus. Yeah, they were nasty. So take your money someplace else. That's it. That's it. And so, uh, anyways, uh, normally this is the part of the video where we say, "Hey, that girl, it's time to hit the Vegas Strip." Now we're gonna say, "Hey, that girl, it's time to check to under the bed for bed bugs." Don't let the bed bugs bite, guys. Well, we'll see you guys next time, hopefully in a better room on the Vegas Strip. Peace. Bye. All right, guys, we are here our last night at the Cromwell. And guess where we're standing? In we're the, the bathroom. bathroom. We're standing in the bathroom because you actually have a window that you can open up and listen. It's just kind of, it's just kind of cool being able to hear the Strip. So, what are your final thoughts on this room? I would stay here if it was cheap, like it was $30 a night because we don't pay resort fees. I would not pay more than that to stay here because the rooms were kind of ick. But once we kind of, you know, the, the bed was fine. And the bed actually was yeah, really comfortable yeah. and sucked us so in. So it definitely has some really good aspects of it. Um, so, But I will warn you if you think you're going to get a fancy stay with an upgraded room, not so much. It's just, honestly, we, we really kind of got sucked into the atmosphere of it, but yeah. they just need to spend a little more time cleaning the rooms, yeah. you know? It's just, it like, it, even the retro furniture, I don't know, like I said earlier, it's like it's like being in a Vegas whorehouse. I don't know what it is, yeah. but, but ended up, we ended up having a good time. Yeah. And, so... Uh, Sorry about the negative dirty review, but it is what it is. It is what it is, guys. So don't pay top dollar for the Cromwell unless they remodel it one day. But if you're looking for something kind of different that isn't the cleanest, but it's wait, cheap. Wait, wait, we might be able to get a room right, right there for pretty cheap right now. No, poor Merle. Poor Merle. So, you know, definitely would still be on the bottom of my list due to how clean it was. But I'd stay here for if it was cheap. Anyways, that's it, guys. Staying at the Cromwell, that girl, that guy. You know what time it is? What time is it, that guy? It's time to hit the Vegas Strip, but it sounds like the Vegas Strip might be hitting us already. <laughs> that's right. Okay. Anyways, guys, it's worth checking out. It, it, it needs to be cleaner, yeah. but it's, you know, wasn't a horrible state. We still had a good time. Peace out, guys. Love you, that girl. Love you, that guy. See you. Bye. Yes.